Hey there guys, and how are you all doing today? My name's Rob aka Chrome Magic, and I thought I'd put up a bit of Halo Reach gameplay for you. This is my fourth game so far. The game came yesterday, um, but I was in London for the day, so couldn't really play it that much. I came on late at night, so had two games and then went off so that I could go and speak to my family for a while. Um, first of all, I'd like to thank Emaxwell458 for inviting me into the game room. I told him that I was a newbie to the game and I'd never played uh, the Halo series before. And he just said that was fine, just to have fun and figure out what the controls were. The rest of the lobby had all the same um, view on it, so they were all happy with playing with a new. And I actually think that I did okay, um, considering that it's my first. It was my first time playing Halo. As I say, this was my fourth gameplay, so I'd got a little bit used to the controls by now. But coming from a Modern Warfare 2 background, obviously, as you can see, the sensitivity is a lot slower, um, and it's a whole different style of game. So I was str I struggled a little bit, but I managed to find an okay gameplay. Um, I went, nine, I got 19 kills and 23 deaths, which I think is okay considering I'm such a noob. Um, so what I'm trying to do is, I'm going to see how well a series would go. And what I'm going to call this series is the progression of Chrome Magic, from being obviously a noob who has never played the game before, to hopefully someone who's a little bit better and knows the tactics of the game more. Um, as you can see here, I'm getting killed a lot, but later on in the game, I do actually pick up a little bit and get a few more kills. I actually tie for the lead at one point, but then get killed, so what can you do? I'm not expecting to be amazing at the game. Um, I'm going to be a noob for a long time. I don't even know whether I'll get any good within about a year. Um, I'm waiting for Black Ops mainly, and this will tie me over until Black Ops. But of course, I'll still play this. Um, I think it's an amazing game. The graphics on it are absolutely fantastic. And I like the fact that it's more unrealistic than Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Um, I like the fact that you have to put more bullets into people. It takes a lot more skill than um, Modern Warfare 2 does. So I'm really happy about that to have a challenge. Um, a lot of the people that I normally play with have said, oh, it's a little bit crap, It whatever. Um, personally, I don't really care. I think it's amazing. Um, as you can see here, the graphics are really good. Um, I'm trying to get used to throwing my grenades a lot more accurately because the grenades on Halo were a lot more um, vital than they are on Modern Warfare. Um, on Modern Warfare, the grenades annoy you a lot. Um, a lot of people don't like using them, or the noob tubes especially. They don't like using those. Um, but on this, really, it's one of the most accepted things to do. It's one of the best ways to get a kill, really. Um, from what I've heard, the best way to kill someone is to throw your grenade, get their shields down, and then take them out with a headshot which was what I was trying to do. I've seen a few games from a few directors um, and a few really good players. I'm not going to mention their names because you'll all say I'm name whoring and I don't want to, I don't really want you to say that. Um, I mentioned Eve Maxwell because he was one of the first Ken campaign people that I've spoken to and he was a really nice bloke um, and he tries to get me into the games whenever possible and try, also try, is willing to help me out on Halo and other games. Um, also, um, I just want to mention the fact that I think he's been offered a Machinima Sports contract. Um, I don't know what he's going to do with it. I haven't spoken to him, but I'll say now that he is worthy of the Machinima contract. He's, um, as I say, and I've said a million times now, he's a great guy. Um, he's also really good at FIFA, although I haven't played him, but I've seen him play, so yeah, I'd like to play him in the future to see how well I got on with him. I think we'd have a couple of good games. Um, so yeah, basically Max, if you're worried about 
I know you were thinking about not taking it because of the HD PVR, but I think you'd be a really good person for it. If you have already accepted it, then congrats. Um, I hope it go it all goes well for you. If you're still worried about it, my personal opinion is go for it, if I'm honest. I know you've got to pay out for a HD PVR, but I don't know whether you get paid for Machinima, but if you do, then you might make some of the money back. Um, I would love, personally love to see you go on the Machinima sports roster because I don't think there's anybody really who deserves it more than you do. Um, it might sound like I'm brown nosing but I'm not. The guy is really a terrific guy. Um, so yeah, enough about that. I'll just say once more thank you to him for making my life a little bit easier in terms of the transition from gaming. Um, so yeah, anyway, this um, series will just show the... I'm not. The guy is really a terrific guy. Um, like that, I'll just say once more thank you to him for making my life a little bit easier in terms of the transition from gaming. Um, so yeah, anyway, this... Um, series will just show the like that I'll just say once more thank you to him for making my life a little bit easier um so yeah anyway this um Like that, I'll just say once more thank you to him for making my life a little bit easier. Remaining. This, um... Like that, I'll just for... Five minutes remaining. This, um... This, um...
remaining. remaining. 